healthy diet. Making the switch to a healthy diet. Switching to a healthy diet doesn't have to be an all or nothing proposition. You don't have to be perfect, you don't have to completely eliminate foods you enjoy, and you don't have to change everything all at once, that usually only leads to cheating or giving up on your new eating plan. Making the switch to a healthy diet. Switching to a healthy diet doesn't have to be an all or nothing proposition. You don't have to be perfect. You don't have to completely eliminate foods you enjoy, and you don't have to change everything all at once, that usually only leads to cheating or giving up on your new eating plan. Making the switch to a healthy diet. Making the switch to a healthy diet. Switching to a healthy diet doesn't have to be an all or nothing proposition. Switching to a healthy diet doesn't have to be an all or nothing proposition. You don't have to be perfect, you don't have to completely eliminate foods you enjoy, and you don't have to change everything all at once. You don't have to be perfect, you don't have to completely eliminate foods you enjoy, and you don't have to change everything all at once. That usually only leads to cheating or giving up on your new eating plan. That usually only leads to cheating or giving up on your new eating plan. A better approach is to make a few small changes at a time. Keeping your goals modest can help you achieve more in the long term without feeling deprived or overwhelmed by a major diet overhaul. Think of planning a healthy diet as a number of small, manageable steps like adding a salad to your diet once a day. As your small changes become habit, you can continue to add more healthy choices. A better approach is to make a few small changes at a time. Keeping your goals modest can help you achieve more in the long term without feeling deprived or overwhelmed by a major diet overhaul. Think of planning a healthy diet as a number of small, manageable steps like adding a salad to your diet once a day. As your small changes become habit, you can continue to add more healthy choices. A better approach is to make a few small changes at a time. A better approach is to make a few small changes at a time. Keeping your goals modest can help you achieve more in the long term without feeling deprived or overwhelmed by a major diet overhaul. Keeping your goals modest can help you achieve more in the long term without feeling deprived or overwhelmed by a major diet overhaul. Think of planning a healthy diet as a number of small, manageable steps, like adding a salad to your diet once a day. Think of planning a healthy diet as a number of small, manageable steps, like adding a salad to your diet once a day. As your small changes become habit, you can continue to add more healthy choices. As your small changes become habit, you can continue to add more healthy choices. Setting yourself up for success. To set yourself up for success, Try to keep things simple. Eating a healthier diet doesn't have to be complicated. Instead of being overly concerned with counting calories, for example, think of your diet in terms of color, variety, and freshness. Focus on avoiding packaged and processed foods and opting for more fresh ingredients whenever possible. Setting yourself up for success. To set yourself up for success, try to keep things simple. Eating a healthier diet doesn't have to be complicated. Instead of being overly concerned with counting calories, for example, think of your diet in terms of color, variety, and freshness. Focus on avoiding packaged and processed foods and opting for more fresh ingredients whenever possible. Setting yourself up for success. Setting yourself up for success.
To set yourself up for success, try to keep things simple. To set yourself up for success, try to keep things simple. Eating a healthier diet doesn't have to be complicated. Eating a healthier diet doesn't have to be complicated. Instead of being overly concerned with counting calories, for example, think of your diet in terms of color, variety, and freshness. Instead of being overly concerned with counting calories, for example, think of your diet in terms of color, variety, and freshness. Focus on avoiding packaged and processed foods and opting for more fresh ingredients whenever possible. Focus on avoiding packaged and processed foods and opting for more fresh ingredients whenever possible. Prepare more of your own meals. Cooking more meals at home can help you take charge of what you're eating and better monitor exactly what goes into your food. You'll eat fewer calories and avoid the chemical additives added sugar, and unhealthy fats of packaged and takeout foods that can leave you feeling tired, bloated, and irritable, and exacerbate symptoms of depression, stress, and anxiety. Prepare more of your own meals. Cooking more meals at home can help you take charge of what you're eating and better monitor exactly what goes into your food. You'll eat fewer calories and avoid the chemical additives, added sugar and unhealthy fats of packaged and takeout foods that can leave you feeling tired, bloated, and irritable, and exacerbate symptoms of depression, stress, and anxiety. Prepare more of your own meals. Prepare more of your own meals. Cooking more meals at home can help you take charge of what you're eating and better monitor exactly what goes into your food. Cooking more meals at home can help you take charge of what you're eating and better monitor exactly what goes into your food. You'll eat fewer calories and avoid the chemical additives, added sugar, and unhealthy fats of packaged and takeout foods that can leave you feeling tired, bloated, and irritable, and exacerbate symptoms of depression, stress, and anxiety. Make the right changes. When cutting back on unhealthy foods in your diet, it's important to replace them with healthy alternatives. Replacing dangerous trans fats with healthy fats, such as switching fried chicken for grilled salmon, will make a positive difference to your health. Switching animal fats for refined carbohydrates, though, such as switching your breakfast bacon for a donut, won't lower your risk for heart disease or improve your mood. Make the right changes. When cutting back on unhealthy foods in your diet, it's important to replace them with healthy alternatives. Replacing dangerous trans fats with healthy fats, such as switching fried chicken for grilled salmon, will make a positive difference to your health. Switching animal fats for refined carbohydrates, though, such as switching your breakfast bacon for a donut, won't lower your risk for heart disease or improve your mood. Make the right changes. Make the right changes. When cutting back on unhealthy foods in your diet, it's important to replace them with healthy alternatives. When cutting back on unhealthy foods in your diet, it's important to replace them with healthy alternatives. Replacing dangerous trans fats with healthy fats, such as switching fried chicken for grilled salmon, will make a positive difference to your health. Replacing dangerous trans fats with healthy fats, such as switching fried chicken for grilled salmon, will make a positive difference to your health. Switching animal fats for refined carbohydrates, though, such as switching your breakfast bacon for a donut, won't lower your risk for heart disease or improve your mood. 
switching animal fats for refined carbohydrates, though, such as switching your breakfast bacon for a donut, won't lower your risk for heart disease or improve your mood. Read the labels. It's important to be aware of what's in your food as manufacturers often hide large amounts of sugar or unhealthy fats in packaged food, even food claiming to be healthy. Read the labels. It's important to be aware of what's in your food as manufacturers often hide large amounts of sugar or unhealthy fats in packaged food, even food claiming to be healthy. Read the labels. It's important to be aware of what's in your food as manufacturers often hide large amounts of sugar or unhealthy fats in packaged food, even food claiming to be healthy. Focus on how you feel after reading. This will help foster healthy new habits and tastes. The healthier the food you eat, the better you'll feel after a meal. The more junk food you eat, the more likely you are to feel uncomfortable, nauseous, or drained of energy. Focus on how you feel after eating. This will help foster healthy new habits and tastes. The healthier the food you eat, the better you'll feel after a meal. The more junk food you eat, the more likely you are to feel uncomfortable, nauseous, or drained of energy. Focus on how you feel after eating. Focus on how you feel after eating. This will help foster healthy new habits and tastes. This will help foster healthy new habits and tastes. The healthier the food you eat, the better you'll feel after a meal. The healthier the food you eat, the better you'll feel after a meal. The more junk food you eat, the more likely you are to feel uncomfortable, nauseous, or drained of energy. The more junk food you eat, the more likely you are to feel uncomfortable, nauseous, or drained of energy. Drink plenty of water. Water helps flush our systems of waste products and toxins, yet many of us go through life dehydrated, causing tiredness, low energy, and headaches. It's common to mistake thirst for hunger, so staying well hydrated will also help you make healthier food choices. Drink plenty of water. Water helps flush our systems of waste products and toxins, yet many of us go through life dehydrated, causing tiredness, low energy, and headaches. It's common to mistake thirst for hunger. So staying well hydrated will also help you make healthier food choices. Drink plenty of water. Drink plenty of water. Water helps flush our systems of waste products and toxins, yet many of us go through life dehydrated, causing tiredness, low energy, and headaches. Water helps flush our systems of waste products and toxins, yet many of us go through life dehydrated, causing tiredness, low energy, and headaches. It's common to mistake thirst for hunger, so staying well hydrated will also help you make healthier food choices. It's common to mistake thirst for hunger. So staying well hydrated will also help you make healthier food choices. For more English lessons, don't forget to subscribe and follow us on Instagram. Thank you for watching.